Um, the last thing I wanted to show before talking about uh, sharing this in Zoom and, and how to share the audio is just to remind us how to share our reactive visuals from Siphon, using Siphon from our Max for Live devices that we've already created. So in um, Live here, uh, add your, uh, here's my patch from a few weeks ago, BSP153 audio reactive visuals for streaming. So I'm going to put that onto an audio track. And just to remind you, this is the most basic and unfun setup, but it was a, just to prove the method. So when I play the audio, there's my reactive visuals, which I'm sure yours look so much nicer. Um, and then in, uh, and just to remind ourselves, this patch was working via by sending um, the result of our um, our reactive audio visuals, uh, audio reactive visuals to this JIT.GL siphon server here um, out of the JIT.world. Um, check out the old videos if you need a refresher on that. Um, I'll just relaunch that device or reinstantiate it just to, there you go, it's working. And then in OBS, in our sources, again, we're going to add and this time, Siphon Client. Um, cool. I'm going to leave it named Siphon Client. And then as a source, we select Live. And then OK. And we can make this fit into uh, whatever space you have left. There we go. And then... Uh, run our audio. There's my reactive visuals as well. Fantastic. And even room to demonstrate one other thing. So that was just a reminder, just a reminder on, um, on adding that. Um, I'll show you how to present in Zoom in the next video.